Hello world, it's Mike with Tutorials Quick, and today I'm going to be talking about some of the new features that have been added to GarageBand with the recent update. So recently Apple updated GarageBand and they added a ton of new features that I'm going to be quickly going over in this tutorial. And in upcoming tutorials I'm going to be kind of going more in depth into them. So let's get started. Let's add a new song. And right away you'll notice that there is a live loops which has been added. So if up at the top here you can switch between either uh, starting off a song in the live loop format or just starting it uh, as normally uh, with a, a tracked instrument. So you can switch between those up here and you'll notice that they have a bunch of different genres of live loops that you can pick from here. Um, these are pre-arranged songs that you can mess around with and kind of create your own song from. Um, if you want to start with a blank slate you just select new here. Let's uh, load one of these up. Let's uh, pick hip hop. And you'll notice that uh, this interface is a little bit different than what you're used to. Um, you have all the loops sectioned out into different cells here on the right. And then you have the tracks that correspond to those on the left. So if you want to play a single loop of a single track, what you're going to do is just tap on the cell. And you kind of mix and match uh, different loops this way. If you want to play a group of loops, what you're going to do is tap on the arrow at the bottom here and it will play all of the loops uh, in the corresponding column. So let's go ahead and let's stop this. Um, another thing that they've added is the effects, which is kind of uh, some DJ effects that you can mess around with. So let's go ahead and play one of these and I'll show you what these do. So that's pretty cool. Um, let's go ahead and stop this again. They also added some new tracks. Let's uh, take a look at those. So they added um, new Chinese instruments, which are pretty interesting, like the uh, Iru. I think that's how you pronounce it. Not really sure. It's kind of like a, a Chinese violin. That's pretty cool. Let's go back. Um, they also added the uh, Chinese pipa, which is kind of like a Chinese lute. Pretty cool. Um, they also added drummer, which is kind of like a uh, an update to the smart drums, but it's uh, way more powerful and uh, way more useful. Uh, I'll be going into this in more depth in upcoming tutorials. Let's go back. And... Last thing they added was a Chinese drum set, which is pretty cool. All right, um, so that's going to conclude this uh, broad overview of the new features that have been added. So stay tuned for upcoming tutorials where I'm going to be going more in depth into all of these. I uh, hope you enjoyed this little overview, and if this helped you at all, please give a like.